The Joint Incident Site Communications capability is the latest in emergency and disaster response technology, and the 439th Communications Squadron is the first in the Air Force Reserve Command to operate it. This system, or GIS as it is referred to, gives military and civilian authorities the ability to communicate with one another during natural disasters and other emergency situations, like earthquakes, hurricanes, and aircraft crashes. Something like uh, the re something recent like Katrina, where you know we have a disaster where the communications is down, and this you know this the GIST package will give us a capability to to get in and get all the different entities, all you know the fire department, uh, the police. Uh, you know, uh, Red Cross to you know the the ability to, to uh, talk to each other across different uh, you know types of communications. If with the fully mobile GIST setup, airmen from Westover can integrate communications from all the different emergency response entities, so communication flows smoothly during a crisis. It gives you the function of an, almost an ISP in a box, and what that does is it allows you to connect through the satellite that's behind me out to the outside world. Some of the system's capabilities include satellite connectivity, voice patching and interoperability, internet connectivity, video teleconferencing, and portable radio communications. Additionally, the package includes a tent, generators, and an HVAC system that allows Westover crews to operate for extended periods in any environment. You know, from start, to, from start time, when we you know, arrive on site until everything is unpacked, and set up it's you know it's very quick and we get everybody talking you know uh, uh, almost immediately